My name is Linda Quinn. I'm on for uh, K-State Research Extension. I am with a program, a grant-funded program, uh, identified as Northeast KCK Healthy Kids. It's uh, a program um, funded by the Robert Woods Johnson Foundation uh, through KC Healthy Kids. KC Healthy Kids hired K-State so that this position comes under them. One of my charges with KC Healthy Kids is to address childhood obesity and some of the other issues facing our community. We've been uh, 105 out of 105 counties in, uh, in the state of Kansas for a number of years. We've moved up to about 97, but our health and wellness is still uh, in need of, of repair. Uh, we're in a food desert, and uh, in this charge, with transportation being an issue, we found that the only way we thought that we may be able to help people access healthy food and healthy choices would be through an online telephone shopping service. We've uh, seeked out uh, a number of different uh, grocery stores in order to try to deliver this service to the community. hy -Vee was very receptive. We're working with the hy -Vee on mission. Uh, they will be uh, delivering uh, food to uh, many people in uh, this community. I'm so excited about connecting for good and uh, bringing the Wi-Fi to Juniper Gardens because in the initial stages, uh, many of the people are not connected to the internet and they were at, would have accessed their shopping by telephone. This is going to make it so much convenient for um, uh, those that provi have been providing the telephone and computers for them that uh, there won't be a long line waiting to order your groceries. You'll be able to do it right from the comfort of your home. Uh, I'm just very excited. Ivy's set up, uh, it's nothing that they created just for us. It's something that they already had. Uh, this particular service is something that's national. Uh, People order their groceries either online, by telephone, often, normally with a, a fee added to it. And IV did have a fee, and we were able to negotiate that fee down. Uh, after researching and looking for um, uh, access to food, we found that this model is something that seems like it was designed for those of us who are uh, situated in a food desert. And uh, very, uh, pleased that hy was willing to partner with us. Uh, the blessings really came when Connect, uh, Connecting for Good uh, decided that they were going to provide Wi-Fi service for the Juniper Gardens area because it really opens up the opportunities for the our neighbors here at Juniper Gardens, not just for accessing food, but accessing all the many resources that we have here in Wyandotte County uh, as far as jobs and uh, food, of course, but health care and, and just getting around. There are many, many of our parents who are packing up their kids every day to get them on the bus, and uh, this is really going to be just so convenient for them. It, uh, it's going to take up our struggles in trying to get transportation for the area. It is definitely going to take the place of transportation and um, connect us to resource. So, Connecting for Good is connecting for good at Juniper Garden.